Hey, I'm a top like, I'm a top worst employee in the world, bro. Nah, Jay, Jay, yeah, yeah, nah, Jay is smarter than me. You were the funniest employee I've ever heard in my life. God said, sorry, Jay, but you were sorry. I was sorry. God said. God said. The only reason why God made me a YouTuber is because He knew I. He knew I was gonna work for a job. I be trying to tell people. I hold every job I ever worked at. I'm talking about once I got paid, I walked out, clear out every job. I'll tell y'all. I worked at Walmart for three days. Three hey, days this, I worked at Walmart. This, 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 this your highlight. This your highlight. This is a, this is a, an astonishing performance. They didn't even complete the orientation that was done. <laughs> no, wait, wait. I completed orientation at Walmart, and then on the first day, I was working, man. It was hot as a bitch pushing baskets. I was out there, I was pushing baskets, and I came back in, and I was like, oh, break right now? And they said, um, they said, no, nah, break in an hour. And in my head, I said, oh, I'm finna quit. So that's what I said in my head. <laughs> so then, an hour went by, and I was pushing baskets. It was like 98 out there, boy. And I was putting the baskets. I said, damn, it's hot. And I said, bro, I can't do this no more, bro. So when I pushed the last basket and I went to go to lunch, I got my car and I went home and I never, <laughs> I never came back. <laughs> I just got my car and left right at lunchtime. It was, I it wasn't even halfway through the day, man. I feel <laughs> bad, but I don't care. Hey, I gotta got get, got get something out of my car. He was gone. Yeah, I told him I gotta get something out of my car. I went right to my car, cause you're not supposed to leave on lunch. I said, I gotta get something out of my car. I got that bitch started, mug up. <laughs> pull out the, I pulled out the, hey, was, hey, man. <laughs> Them niggas, I ain't never go back to that Walmart. I never went back to that Walmart, bro. Not even a shop at that bitch. I never went back to there. And what then it was the one in Denver. It was the it was it was the hood Walmart. I fucking told them niggas not to make me work there. I said, no, <laughs> let me work at the good Walmart on the right side. Them niggas, I, I'm gonna work first. I said, man, why am I at this hood shit? Come on. Wait, 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 wait. Didn't you uh to, to get your check? You, you said Calvin in there, right? Yeah, I said, Calvin, I said, my nigga, we drove back. I said, I got to get my check, though. I did work four days, three days and a half. I need to get my check. Calvin walked up in there, and they said, this. he said, hey, yeah, y'all got the check from Mark. And they, they gave him the check, bro. I know they was hot, bro. I did not go back in there, bro. Never went back to the Walmart, bro. Calvin went there, got the hell. He walked out. He was rolling. He, they, he said that nigga was hot. He said they was hot. He just said they was hot. I'm trash, though. I quit so many uh, jobs. Hey, there was a job called Deco. And they said work 6 to 6, 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. And I went up there, and I didn't get picked the first day because it was like a work on something. So I didn't get picked the first day. Second day, I didn't get picked. Third day, I got picked. And then I just, I don't know why. I woke up at 6 a.m. and everything. I got there, got picked, and I just walked out. I said, I don't feel like doing this shit today. <laughs> I, I went back to the car. I just went home, bro. I went back to sleep, bro. I didn't even I didn't even start that job, nigga. I'm horrible, bro. Only job I stayed at. I just slept. Only job I stayed at was the movie theater. I worked at AMC, and that was it was pretty fun. But until, all right, y'all, Big Hero Six came out. I remember the line was long, and these kids they was on the way out. Badass kids almost whooped their ass in front of their parents, but they're badass kids. One of them was walking out with an icy, and I promise y'all, he just he grabbed his icy, and he just stuck that on the wall. The nigga said, "Mop." I said, "You got me fucked up." I said, "I don't know why you did that, cause I promise, I promise to God, I ain't cleaning that up." <laughs> so this why this is exactly what I did. And that white girl, there was this white girl, she was younger than me, bro. And and she, she I don't I, I don't know why. She was like a year younger than me, but she was my manager. So every time she tell me to do something, I'm looking at her like she, she was a prodigy. I, no, she was 17. I was like 21. That's what it was. I was in college. I said, every time she told me to work, like do something, I'd be like, nigga, you 17. What the fuck? Nigga, you can't tell me what to do. What are you talking about? So I just didn't take that job seriously. And then there was this other white girl up there. And like, y'all, I worked in like a white neighborhood. It was next to my college at UNT. It was like 30 minutes away. That was the only AMC job I could get. So when I walked in there, they, they treated me like a, a fucking African king. Because no other black people worked there. No other black people worked there. It's like, I feel like all the little, like, all the little white girls had a crush on me or something. They did everything for me. I didn't have to work at all. Like, this what, nigga, what he, you walked, mean? he walked out the theater, bro. Nigga said, Bleh! he threw up. I said, yeah. <laughs> who supposed to clean that up? I'm not cleaning that nigga <laughs> throw up. And I just was looking at it. It was my jurisdiction. I was supposed to clean it up. I was looking at it. And the white girl, she said, you want me to get it? I said, yeah. And she went up there and cleaned the hell up. And I was like, thank you. And she was like, oh, no problem. She used to help me with everything, nigga. I ain't clean nothing up. I'm telling y'all, man. God bless. That nigga for real, is funny, hey, bro. Hey, bro. That shit was. I don't know what happened. I had plot armor for real, for real. I had plot armor. For real.
That nigga said African king. They really was treating me like an African king. <laughs> bro, that nigga, that nigga told me he quit Walmart in three days, but I, I think that's probably one of the hardest laughs I've had, bro. I did AMC got- wrong too because they said at the at the month I worked there, the motherfucking general manager, he was like, "Hey, Mark, if you keep working like this, maybe you can become a general manager here too." And and, 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 I, and he was like, he said, "Yeah, because I've been working here for fifteen years." I said, "Fifteen years." <laughs> I quit. I quit because that nigga had me fucked up. I don't know why he thought I was going through college to wait, wait, to, no, did, to work didn't, they tell you, bro, did, didn't they sell you? They made you go to to, to like a, a mandatory meeting, and you had to stay. No, that was the last straw. Like I already made up my mind to quit at that after he told me fifteen years. But when I walked into, they said mandatory meetings at six a.m. and then they put my shit. Hold on, they put my work shift at nine after the meeting. I said, uh huh. <laughs> what you talking about? <laughs> nine to, bro, it was like nine to six. And I said, from, but you want me to go up there at six first? I said, okay, okay. What you think I did? What you think I did? At 6 a.m. after that mandatory meeting, they said, you might as well stay here since you got to work in like an hour. I said, okay, let me just go to my car and get something. Out that bitch. I ain't seen them again. I ain't seen them one more time. No kidding. That's the scheme, bro. They can't be doing that shit. Who can't? Them corporations. They can't be doing that shit. Bro, I'm fucking dead. Oh, bro, that nigga is the funniest nigga on the planet, bro. Nigga, any, any any nigga don't believe me, you must not know me, bro. I'll tell you, I quit every job, on, on, and I did. I never quit. I never quit. Like, hey man, I quit. I just walked out that bitch. I, wow, we ain't gonna see each other no more. I don't need to tell you nothing. All your walks in the chat. All your leaders in the chat.